Hey everyone, welcome to another gluten-free fitness product review. Tonight what I have to speak with you about is some information and some products from Protos Food Inc. First of all, to get the legal information out of the way, um, Fitfluential LLC compensated me for this sponsored post. All thoughts and opinions are my own. This is part of an ongoing project that Fitfluential is doing with GNC, General Nutrition Centers. And these are products that can be found at your local GNC store or online. So, having said that, what I'm going to be discussing tonight are two different products that are currently being made by Protus Foods. One of them is um, jerky products. So, ostrich specifically, ostrich and beef, and they have a new turkey jerky. So, this is the new, the, the, the where is it? This one. Yeah, it's like I got playing cards with jerky. But we have this is the new Ostrom snack stick, which is turkey. Turkey. <laughs> now these are handy because obviously they're shelf stable. And you can throw them in your purse, your backpack, anything like that without having it make a mess or melt. So that's always convenient because you never know when you will need something that's um, shelf and temperature stable. This would be handy to keep in those situations. I have been known, actually, in, in the past to carry chicken breasts with me. <laughs> Not even lying. Chicken breasts with me in my purse. So this would be a much more clean and less messy alternative with considerable less risk of getting onto everything else in your bag because it's packaged. So you have some different choices with the Ostrom products the jerky, but I want to make one thing very, very clear. If you are an individual with celiac disease or gluten sensitivity, do not eat the teriyaki flavor because it has soy sauce and therefore has wheat. Do not eat the teriyaki flavor, okay? Having said that, we'll move on to the other flavors which we have here, which is the apple wood of the turkey and the natural original ostrich, which is a beef and ostrich jerky. And then we have the pepper flavor, beef and ostrich jerky. And lastly, their new jerky snacks, which are is a flatter jerky. The original ones are rounder, kind of like a, like a fatter version of a Slim Jim. And the jerky, J-E-R-K-E-E -E -E jerky is flat. So it's more like a strip. And to be honest, I like the consistency of the jerky, the flat strip kind better than the roll. Just a personal preference. No idea why that is, but for some reason I do prefer the, the flat kind. For the flavors, the natural flavor is good, but I definitely prefer the pepper flavor. It has a little bit more of a kick. And um, I did like the turkey as well. All of these nutritionally cover right around 100, um, just under 100 calories and give you about 14 grams of, of protein, which is primarily what you're looking for in a snack like this. They do have a considerable amount of sodium, which you would expect in these products. And um, they do have a little bit of fat, but not as much as you would see in a traditional jerky. Um, because the ostrich is a quite a quite lean product actually, and there is um, milk in the ostrim products. So if you have a sensitivity to dairy, you definitely want to be on the lookout for that. And and that brings up another really good point that I just wanted to be clear: ingredients change all the time, lists change all the time by the manufacturers. So. Just because I do a product review, whether it's here or on the blog, if something's gluten-free at the time that I do the review, it doesn't necessarily mean that it's going to stay that way. Yes, I just made an adjustment. That's my hair. So make sure that before you eat anything, especially if you have celiac disease, gluten intolerance, or any other food sensitivities or allergies, check your labels, check your ingredients each time you pick something up because things change. So, Ostrom. Really good option if you need something that's shelf stable, will not melt, and has a minimal amount of odor. Just like any other jerky product, if you've ever opened it, when you open it, it does have a little bit of an odor. Uh, it's got that, that seasoning odor that you can smell. 
so when I take these on the plane tomorrow, because I have to travel, <laughs> I'm quite certain that my neighbor will probably recognize that I'm eating jerky, but that's okay. It could be worse. I could have hard boiled eggs on the plane with me. I've done that before too. So, good option, high protein snack, easily transportable, doesn't melt. Keep that in mind. Don't eat the teriyaki. Moving on, Protus Foods also has a new product out and they're titled Gimme. So the idea with the Gimme products is that they basically are taking something that's very similar to a candy and I'll open this up so that you can see them. I'll try to open it up. I'm still in the break, so it's kind of hard. Probably should have done this next time. So they are shaped like a candy who that we all know and love. Right? Very similar. Candy on the outside. On the inside, these are different types of cocoa or chocolate. This particular one is a 45% cacao. And there's four different varieties. With these four different varieties, they put nutrition in a candy. That's the idea of Gimme. It's basically putting something that's fairly nutritious inside something that looks like a candy, tastes like a candy. Oh, and they actually say, candy with benefits. That's the, the Gimme tagline. So the thing that concerns me about the Gimme products is on each and every one of them, there's the disclaimer, may contain peanuts, tree nuts, and wheat. So for someone with celiac disease or gluten intolerance, this is not something that you would necessarily want to include in your diet. I did taste one just to taste it so I could report to you guys what they tasted like. And the, ingredient, the main ingredients in these are basically a, a crisp rice. That's what's inside the chocolate, the candy coating. So when you bite into it, it's like, um, it, you know, like an old-fashioned Rice crispy type thing in the middle. So it's, it's candy on the outside, then a chocolate coating, then the crisp rice on the inside with the, the vitamin or whatever it is that they're adding into it to make it um, candy with benefit. So this particular one has some omega-3s added. This one has vitamin D. This one has probiotics. And then the last one has added calcium. And this one has is also with milk chocolate. The others are with darker chocolate. So after tasting it, I just, like I said, I only had one because of the may contain wheat, and I didn't want to make myself sick. Now, there is no gluten-containing gluten containing ingredients in these, but it looks like it could have been cross-contaminated in processing, which makes me very, very cautious. Now, the other thing with these particular candies, the issue that I have personally, is that if I want candy, I'll have candy. And then I'll make sure that I have a nutritionally balanced diet and or additional supplementation to get the items that I need. I don't necessarily personally want to compromise candy with the fact that it's got a little bit of extra nutrition in it. That's just my personal opinion. Um, your opinion may vary, your mileage may vary, but again, if you have celiac disease or gluten intolerance, definitely be aware that these may contain wheat ingredients. It's not something that I would eat. And Personally, I'd rather have some really good ice cream and then make sure that my diet is well balanced and nutritionally sound otherwise, rather than eating one of these to get a little bit of extra benefit. So, Proto Foods Incorporated, you can find them on Twitter or on Facebook. These are two of their products. The Ostrom, which is a handy, shelf-stable, temperature-stable jerky that gives you a lot of protein and their Jimmy snacks. So, hope that you guys enjoy this, get a little bit out of it. Remember, if you have celiac disease or gluten intolerance, don't eat the teriyaki, and be careful with the Jimmy's. Take care, y'all.